In this guide, I'll show you how to turn on or enable Team Create on Roblox Studio. So whether it's an old game you've been working on or you want to create a new game by selecting it in the top left corner, what you want to do is open up your world. So once you're in your game, what you want to do is have a look in the top left and you want to select a view. And this is going to give you a bunch of different options. So what you want to do is click on the Team Create icon here. It may not show the name. It does for me though. And then if you have a look on the left sidebar, you'll see Team Create. So what you want to do is select Save to Roblox. Then under Basic Info, you want to give your game a name. So I'm just going to name mine Castle. And you want to scroll down on this page and where it says Team Create, you want to toggle this feature on. This enables collaboration with other friends and auto save to the cloud. Now you can also update existing games if you want to ensure that Team Create is toggled on for those as well. And once you're happy with these settings, go to save in the bottom right corner. So now if you have a look on the left sidebar, you'll see Team Create and everyone who's able to edit the game. And if you want to add friends so they're able to edit it, select the person icon with the plus sign in the top right corner. And you can search for your friends at the top using this search bar. And what you're able to do is change it from play and you can change their character to edit so they can play and edit this game. Then what you want to do is press save at the bottom. And now you want to go to roblox.com. So once you're signed into your Roblox account on roblox.com, what you want to do is select create at the top. Then from here, you want to find the experience that you're currently working on in the Roblox studio. So if you don't see it on the home page, you can go right here. And what you want to do is select the three dots where the name is, and you want to copy this URL. Then if you put your URL in the top and you search for it, it'll bring you to this page here. And essentially what you want to do is send that URL we just copied to your friend so they can go to edit in studio and access this as well. If this guide was helpful, like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.